Well, it's happened to a lot of us while waiting in the line at the supermarket. You take a look at those tabloids and can't help but notice Hollywood's hottest stars on their dream vacation. Don't you wish it was you looking great on the white sand beaches, sun shining, not a care in the world? But you often need to fork out major cash just to book a dream vacation. Well, our next guest says, not anymore. Celebrity style expert Bobby Thomas joins us with tips on how to score a deal on resort getaways and how to escape in style without spending a lot of money. Bobby, welcome. All right. Hi, well, thanks for having me, Lisa. All right, so spring fever is setting in. I know a lot of us are uh, thinking about getting away. I would love to go to a resort, but I don't want to spend a whole lot of money. What do you suggest? Well, you need to sneak away and come check out where I am. I am just outside of Palm Springs at a Waldorf Astoria property. It's called La Quinta Resort and Club. And I just need to tell you, birds are chirping. There are mountains surrounding me, 40 pools, nine golf courses. Everybody's happy and an amazing spa. Um, it's all about really looking into membership programs. Those celebrities that you see in the photos aren't necessarily paying that price tag you see quoted for the room. They travel for work. They're really savvy about looking into the points they earn for travel and taking advantage of them. Another thing they do is they're loyal. If you're loyal, you get a little bit of love. And I'm teaming up here with Hilton Honors to spread the word about their current promotional program if you book five consecutive nights, you get the fifth night free in their resort escapes um, program. Oh. And that helps you save right off the top. And so before you run to the websites of these aggregate you know, websites out there to try to get the best or lowest rate, consider going to the source because oftentimes you'll find a lot of other perks like no blackout dates, for example, with honors and other things. But right, so we're looking that's at just one many many ways to save you know oftentimes many ways to save yes many ways oftentimes just getting there can cost a lot of money and it's getting expensive to fly if you pack too much so we're i know i'm packing a little less but how do we do it with getting all the right clothes there i am right there with you because not only do i have to pack for myself and bring all of these examples to show you but I pack for my models too. My beautiful friends, Melanie and Jenny are here with me. So I do want to save money and space and some of my insider tips. Before I go to the dress section in a store, I'll hit the swimsuit section because cover-ups often cost less than sundresses. And this is not only a beautiful gown for the beach, you can put it over your bathing suit, but if you add leggings and sandals, you also have a really great option to go shopping and to dinner. And then you can also add a scarf and boots and wear this year round, you know, in your own wardrobe. I rocked that exact swimsuit cover up in New York many times um, to go out to dinner. Also, I don't leave home without my adult blankie, but this is really called a Cardi wrap like we see on Jenny, this gorgeous blue sweater. You can wrap up in the plane, but you can also in your suitcase pull this out as an alternative to what you've worn all trip long if you get bored and have seven different ways to wear that Cardi wrap as a top. And so that's something that's really smart to pack along with a scarf that we all know scarves are versatile, but one thing I do heed is to leave the expensive jewelry behind. You don't wanna worry about it in the room or losing right. it. If you tie knots into a scarf like this, you can make it thinner. It looks like a statement necklace and you're able to just add that pop of color so you can chill on the makeup. And of course all of, that is, all of that is light. Uh, you know, it, light, gets in it, our, it gets in our luggage and doesn't weigh as much, but what about shoes? That's where my luggage gets weighed down we again should be BFFs because I want to take the whole closet with me and <laughs> men have this problem too. But here is the secret. Yes, skin tone shoes, we hear all the buzz about how they'll elongate your figure, etc. That's great. But they, because they match your skin tone, they'll go away and they'll match with everything you bring. So really the secret is, is to get a great pair of wedges or sandals or flip flops in a tone that matches your skin. So it kind of blends away and you don't have to bring a bunch of shoes. Also think about your beauty. Don't drag all the hair products with you. I actually am wearing this faux Chia Pet looking thing called the Fun Bun <laughs> on my um, hair. It'll make you look like you just tossed it up and it'll get you a few extra days. You can also find dry shampoo to help you get by, but all of those beauty tips and more, including the hotels under the Hilton umbrella, there are 10 different distinct brands like the Waldorf Astoria that are all participating in this great resort escapes promotion. That is all on 
honors.com slash escape. And Bobby, we will have that on our website. Thank you so much for all that great advice. And like I said, for more information on what Bobby discussed today, go to delmarvalife.com and click on the show tab. Still ahead on Delmarva Life, adults aren't the only ones who get stressed out, so do children. See how yoga is keeping these kids calm, cool, and collected. And while we're talking kids' health, Dr. Oz says it's important to keep an eye on their weight. Hi, I'm Dr. Oz. Childhood obesity has nearly tripled over the last three decades. Do you know the number one warning sign? Check your child for a skin condition marked by darkening or thickening in the folds that appear on the back of the neck, armpit, or groin. If your child is obese, discuss with their doctor.